Rich Thomas Weather Network is brought to you by these fine sponsors. Well, hello. Good morning. It is Tuesday morning, the 19th day of April already. What's going on with this month? It is going quickly. Temperature is 54 degrees as I make this video at 10 minutes after 4 in the morning. It'll be closer to the 50 degree mark by the time the sun rises this morning. So yeah, you know, a jacket will feel great, but we'll be in the low 80s for a couple of days. Big bubble of high pressure is protecting us now, but showers and storms are in the forecast for late week. I've got the latest on timing and intensity of that storm system. It's moving a little slower now. I'll have the latest for you, plus an update on your weekend and a great space station flyover this evening. A bright one, one that is worth your time. Here we go with the details. When you look at this map and you see the big storm system out to the west of us, it looks like we're about to get rain any time, but we still have a protective bubble over us up at 20,000 feet. That big ridge of high pressure keeping storms at bay. So more warm, dry weather for us today uh, with the storm system still out to the west of us. Plenty of sunshine here. We're back in the low 80s. We had 80 yesterday. I think we're at 83 today. Sunny and warm. Winds light out of the southeast at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tonight's low should be down to about 56 and looking ahead to tomorrow. Still a warm day. Southerly winds take over. Maybe a little bit more humidity. Clouds on the increase, but the storm system is still out to the west of us. Thursday afternoon now, the chances of showers and thunderstorms increasing. In fact, I'll show you a future radar here. And you can see the showers and storms um, in the western counties moving into central Alabama Thursday afternoon and into Thursday evening. Storm Prediction Center keeps no risk of severe weather in our forecast. They do have a marginal risk out to the west in Louisiana and Texas on Thursday. Midday Friday. Now, this is slowing down. I was thinking the rain would be out of here early Friday. Right now, we're going to have to keep a chance of showers and thunderstorms in the forecast through Friday and through much of Friday. And then Saturday morning, I think it's gone with the start of a great weekend and the storm system out to the east of us by then. I see low pressure near uh, Jacksonville, Florida on Sunday morning, but I think our weather should be beautiful. Uh, lots of sunshine, warm temperatures into the low 80s. In fact, 83 tomorrow with partial sunshine, 50% chance of showers and storms by Thursday afternoon with a high around 80, 60% chance on Thursday night into Friday, Friday's high in the upper 70s, near 80 on Saturday with mostly sunny skies and lower 80s on Sunday. The, G, uh, the European model out 10 days only shows the one storm system over the next 10 days, and that's the one we're dealing with by late Thursday into Friday. And then it has a dry, warm period. And look at the temperatures on the GFS. Don't take the actual numbers verbatim, but look at the warm period of time we have for the next couple of weeks through the end of this month into the early part of May. Pretty exciting stuff. Hey, there is a great space station flyover tonight, a bright one from about 8.13 to 8.15. Look at the northwest sky. It moves overhead just around, uh, let's say, 8.14 and then out of view at 8.16. It should be a good one. Hey, thanks again to Lisa. Lisa's always sending us these great pictures of sunset up around Lake Jordan. That's one from yesterday evening with a few high clouds accentuating that beautiful sunset uh, going over the horizon there. Have you checked out uh, our website yet? This is the uh, one that's been up for several weeks now, richthomasweathernetwork.com, where you can get all of these videos, uh, all of the Facebook posts and tweets and live streaming during severe weather, radar, hourly forecasts, extended forecasts, sign up for weather alerts as well. And our new app, which will be out any day now, will be uh, mirroring that website. So you'll be able to have that in the palm of your hand. And pretty cool stuff too. Are you absolutely loving this weather? How could you not? It feels more like May than it does April, right? Hey, no weather video tomorrow morning, no Wednesday morning video, but we'll be back in action on Thursday morning at the regular time, just before five o'clock in the morning. But you can hear my forecast all day long tomorrow on all the Blue Water radio stations, the entire eight radio station group. I hope you have a great day today. I'll check you out later. And again, see you on Thursday morning. Rich Thomas Weather